Howie. Hello, how are you going? Good, thank you. Awesome. It's good. Can we, we'd like to interview on the electricity usage that you use That's during cool. the day okay. at school. Yep. Um, how many appliances do you have in your room or like room and staff room that require electricity? Printers, we only have one printer. We have two staff computers, plus every staff member, which is about eight of us, has a computer. Okay. Um, and any other devices, I'm not sure what those devices are. Okay. How many of them are kept on during the night and over weekends and holidays? Um, I'll take mine home, so I don't know. Um, I'm assuming if we go about half, I think, we left on the charge or not. Well, okay. Yeah. Do you have to leave them on all night, or is it out of habit that you leave them on? Um, we leave them on all night so they can charge, because it generally flat at the end of the day. That's our personal computers. The other staff computers are on all the time, because people don't like them turned off. During holidays as well? Um, during the holidays, I'm not so sure about holidays, but during, certainly during the week and over the weekends, the two main staff computers are left turn, turned on, and so is the printer. Yeah. Okay, we can answer that do you keep your lights on when there's enough light? During the day, do you leave your lights on? No. In class, or the staff room, in class, myself, if there's enough light, I won't have the lights on. The lights stay on all day in the staff room. Do they? Hi, Miss Carl. Hi, girls. We were wondering if we could interview on the electricity that's been wasted in the school. Certainly, go ahead. Um, how many appliances do you have in your room and staff room that you generate electricity? That use electricity. That use electricity. Printer, computer, phone. That's all. How many are kept um, on during the night and over weekends? All of them. All of them? Do you have to leave them on or is it just out of habit that you leave them on? It's out of habit and laziness because they take so long to boot up in the morning. Um, okay. Do you keep your lights on during no. the day? Oh, so, sometimes, okay. yes, if it's a darkish day. Okay, just letting you know you don't need them on. Yes. Well, so, sometimes. In the afternoon I do because yeah. the sun goes away. Yes, good point. Yeah. I'll remember that. That's all. Just pop over there and turn them off. The electricity bill is over $10,000, which is really expensive and is a lot of money that gets wasted on the school's electricity bill instead of... Wait, hold on, cut, 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 cut. Oh, the school's electricity bill is over ten thousand dollars, which is a lot of money. Money that could could be spent on better equipment for our education. The purpose of this film is to warn you teachers about the amount of electricity you're using and how much money it costs. We're here to try and stop you, to try and bring down your electricity, so that this bill's not as big. One of our ideas is to have an Earth Hour, maybe once or twice a semester, have an entire hour where everything is turned off, computers, the um equipment in the staff rooms in the office, the printers, everything turned off for one hour. Another one of our ideas is to get light switches, an hour light switch, which lasts for about as long as a period. Therefore, when you leave, you don't have left on lights. The science already has um, light switches, but they're two hour light switches. Meaning if you were to leave at the end of the day, there's still another two hours before your lights are gone, which is a lot of power that gets used. Every month, the school is using ten thousand dollars or more on electricity, and like that's just shame. So, pretty much what I'm trying to say is save electricity. Watching our video on how to save electricity, it was done by me, Michaela Young, Tali Bennett, and Alex Rash. And our message to all your teachers out there is to save electricity.